everyone. I have been waiting so long to make this video. Our company has done some restructuring. Now I am no longer able to get the new releases early. It's so sad. It's like my favorite thing in the world to be able to get them early and show them to everybody before they're actually available to everybody else. So I'm a little bit sad about that. But hopefully someday um, we can get back to the way it used to be and I can get them early again. Um, between that and the fact that we have COVID happening and social distancing in our warehouse, shipping is super delayed. So it's almost the end of July here. I just got the new releases for July yesterday, but I'm really excited to show them to you. I have almost all of them and everything else you can check out on the website. So I'll start with That's Not My Bus. This one is just such a great addition to the series. Every page has a different touchy-feely texture on it. It's really great for kids who are learning how to read. It's got board book pages, so you don't have to worry about your younger kids wrecking it. It's just great. My son is almost seven, and he said, I think that should go in my keep pile. So you're never too old for a That's Not My Touchy Feely book. Also excited about this one, I absolutely love this little board book series. They have cute pictures, cute stories. It's about the size of my hand, so it's great for just little ones who are just learning to explore books. This one is all, all about the sunny day. So early in the morning, the sun peeps over the edge of the world. Hello, new day. And it just goes on and on, and it shows you all of these beautiful things that you can see in the world on a sunny day. So... So many great books in this series. Can't wait for them to just keep coming out with more and more and more. Love this series too. Numbers, puzzles, and games. The other one we have is word puzzles and games, I think. And I actually kept one for myself because I really just like them. So it's just packed with all sorts of fun activities that you can do. I usually take them on car rides or if I'm having a slow day at work, take that with me and keep me busy. Very, very excited about this one. The Amazing Discoveries of a 100 Brilliant Scientists. So this is a STEM book. I'm going to read you the back. From atoms to x-rays and from the Big Bang to the internet, brilliant breakthroughs by successful scientists have changed the world again and again. Dip inside this intriguing book to read the stories of a 100 scientists and their amazing discoveries. And the pages are like a, like a glossy type page. I don't know. I really, really think it's just so beautiful. And it's just the perfect addition to every bookshelf, I think. It's fascinating. I really like at the back. So it has all of this stuff. And it's just like two-page spreads. So here's how a falling apple changed science forever. Um, discovering the deadly truth about dangerous pesticides. How scientists from a chilly climate predicted global warming. So it has all of these amazing discoveries at the end. There is a timeline that you can look through to see when these discoveries were made. There's more of a timeline. I guess there's a few pages of timelines. And then what I really like about it is that it has a glossary in the back. So if kids are reading and they don't really understand what astrophysics is or what's an electron or what are chromosomes or whatever, they can come to the back and read about it and it will just help them understand what they're reading better so very very excited about this one very excited about this one also the unhurry book we have actually quite a few books that we're getting more and more of that deal with mental health um we have another one too that i'll show you at the same time the unworry magic painting book the unhurry book just getting people to slow down breathe take a minute to relax um take care of your mental health and and we have other books that actually cover mental health um, as a topic, but this one is just basically a relaxing activity book for busy brains. This book is all about taking a little time to breathe, focus, and be calm. Try a spot of yoga, color and soothing squiggles, or write a poem. Take a quiet moment just for you. And I think it's great. It's just like a little workbook. And I don't know. I can't say enough good things about it. I think it's fabulous. My oldest daughter, who is 14 completely obsessed with magic painting books. Of all my kids, she loves them the most. And when I showed her this yesterday, she's like, you ordered that for me, right? Because she said, this is the book she's always wanted, but didn't know how to explain what it was. This is relaxing to her. 
I think um, when you're 14 and you have all those teenager things going on and hormones and friends and just our world is in complete chaos and something like this where you can just kind of shut down your mind and just relax and focus, I, I think it's great. It's perfect for babies, toddlers, anybody who can just learn how to hold a paintbrush because you just wet it, dip it in water and, and then it just all of the color comes to life as soon as the water touches it. But she just loves all the patterns in it, all the squiggles. She takes these for car rides. She'll sit in her room and just do them. All of my kids like them, but she definitely likes them the most. So really excited about this Unworry book. And the last one that I have here to show you is Build Your Own Website for Beginners, which is very cool. Design and build a real working website from scratch using HTML, CSS and JavaScript. Um, it has step-by-step -step instruction. It's especially written for beginners. It has a really great table of contents. And it just has everything that you need to know about creating your own website. So very cool. I am excited. My daughter was like, oh, I've always wanted to make a website. So I guess I'll let her play around and see what she can come up with. There were two books that I did not order. One of them was a wipe clean comprehension book and the other one was a beginner book about the beach. Um, so if you want to check those out, feel free to head on over to the website and take a look. We have a new website. Um, it has some glitches. It's still working out, so everything is not perfect, but it is coming along tomorrow, which is July 31st. All of the new August releases are going to be released, so make sure you check those out too. Super excited to get them here and make another video for you guys. So um, find me on Facebook. If you need help finding any books on the website and you're struggling, make sure you let me know. And that's it for me. I hope you guys all have a great month, and I'll see you guys all again soon. Bye!